Um, I will say, out of the past television season, there have been few fandoms that have gotten as devoted as the Hannibal Fanables. Hannibal Fanables? Yeah, they call, they, they call themselves the Fanables. So it like yeah. So have you kind of been getting approached a lot because you are now tied with the show? Um, well, yes. I, I came here thinking I was talking about Little Shop, but I'm talking about Hannibal. But I would be very happy to because I was supposed to come here with Brian Fuller. Oh. He was going to be my date, and he got taken whisked away to bed. <laughs> He's working on another sci-fi show at the same time. But uh, I'm thrilled. I mean, Brian Fuller is synonymous with great work. And anything he touches is gold. And I suggest more Hannibal Fanables. I love that. What were the Pushing Daisies people called? But it was just sort of like no, I think the I do first. I mean, I, I think just, you know, I don't, the, they were, uh, I know that a lot of them, like the Pie Maker, like lovers. So, like, I don't know, like, because the Pie Maker, so I'm like, I know, like, there was a fan site, like, the Pie Maker. Yeah, so that was a great fan site. Yeah. yeah. So, in terms of just the show, I mean, what is it like reuniting with Brian? I mean, you obviously have a great affection for this man. Oh, I and you love guys Brian. I call for him every Christmas. And I was like, that's the cutest Brian. thing ever. <laughs> what is working together to kind of bring out a new creative? Oh, golly. Everything. Everything. When, uh, when someone believes in you, I'm Ed Peters. I'm Peters. you can do anything. Uh, I have Richard Sherman. And on, uh, actually, that's YTV. very similar with Howard Ashton. Uh, 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 Howard Ashton let me go when I created Audrey. Uh, and he uh, just loved me uh, and believed in me. And it wasn't uh, sure she should be blonde. Uh, it was really against uh, Let me finish. Uh, and with Brian Fuld, it's the same thing. Um, he, he loves you. He loves his talent. He loves creating. Um, he, he, uh, the only thing is he does so much from beginning to end. I mean, he's in the editing from the very beginning of concerts. And so his toes and his costumes and music and everything. So he is really busy. And I do miss him. Just haven't seen much of him. But um, he promises me a party dinner. <laughs> but um, no, uh, it, 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 it's, it's great because people love working with him because he's so kind. And he loves his actors. Yeah. He's so kind. And he, you know, his actors love him because the characters he writes are so unique and complex and uh, individual. And they have so much depth. They have a lot of humanity. I mean, Vivian was a great character. I love the team. Um, I think it's great. I can't remember who it was. I get it. That's because it was a nice girl. I think it's great to. Well, I'll say it with Ellen. I think it's great to try to be happy. Such a great line. Amazing line. Yeah. Great to try to be happy. Yeah. It's not always easy. No. Not and to have courage to say, no, I am going to choose to try to stay on the positive side of life. Anyhow, there's so many reasons I love him. Yeah. But, um, he's got a great host. That's a good thing to have. Has he kind of hinted as to whether you'll be back next season to you? Oh, he told me I will be. Okay, good. When so we he have it all. Up, I was so excited. And he said, no, now that you're established, we'll I hope I'm developed. <laughs> Excellent. Well, I mean, given how many popular shows are having a comeback these days, do you think about, like, where the Darling Mermaid Darlings might be these days, or do you kind of just, like, look at that fondly in the past? In Brian's brain, and actually, I know he's written most of the film, and since I know the storyline, I know where he's going with it, so... Uh, there have been too many incarnations. Yeah, I know the last one. Um, and so I know where they're going. And I know where we were going originally when we stopped. Yeah. So I will say, is as tragic as that cancellation was, because that was a beautiful show, that was a beautiful series finale as well, too. That, that those final five minutes Brian, ended up... Yeah. Brian made that on the fly. That was amazing. Brian created that entire ending on the fly. Yeah. It was... Because it was supposed to be starting a new yeah. chapter. And uh, obviously, Vivian and uh, yeah. Susie and I were right in the middle of an argument. Yeah, yeah. I, I mean, that's so wonderful. I mean, he's just so surprising. He doesn't, he's not, he's so eclectic in his case that you don't, he's not 
unpredictable. Yeah. And so that's wonderful. But what he, all of his characters have, Hannibal, everybody have So you can see the human side of a villain and the mean side of a sweet person or the self side. He's just wonderful playing all the ends at the same time. So.